Hello, hello, hello. So this is episode two of my Fun Fat Loss series. So for those of you that don't know me, I am Anri and I am your holistic health coach as well as your weight loss coach or rather fat loss coach. Um, so in episode two, which is where we are at now, um, we are looking at the word you. So again, I'm breaking up Fun Fat Loss for the series. So the second letter is you. So the you in fun fat loss will stand for unique. Okay, so this is a very important because obviously all of us are unique. You guessed it. Okay, so it's important to know and to find your unique way and your individual way um, on your health and fat loss journey. And here it's important to look at different ways that will suit your lifestyle, your personality, and yeah, it, that will work with you on a daily basis. Because again, it's what we do consistently that matters and that brings about change. So you need to bring something into your life and find your unique plan and your unique way um, that you can actually continue doing. So again, building on the previous one, episode one, which was fun and focus. So after you've set your goal and you've made it fun, it's important to then incorporate tools um, that work for you. So you be you, right? And um, again, it's important to look at lifestyle change where, as I've mentioned in episode one, where mindset is really important. So we all have unique minds and also tap in here about what you're currently thinking. So in this moment, what is your self-talk like? Do you tend to talk to yourself negatively? Like when you look in the mirror and you say, oh, you're so disgusting, you're pathetic, you're so fat, you're so ugly, or whatever it is. Is that your narrative so how you talk to yourself or is it positive like in the way of um you're beautiful and yes we um, can do anything we believe in um is it more like that because self-talk is really really a crucial factor when we look at your health and weight loss journey um, because the way you talk to yourself and most of us don't even realize how we talk to each other so as i always say number one is awareness we can't bring about life changes or lifestyle changes if we're not aware of what the issue is so become aware of your self-talk and within the next episode i will talk a little bit around that so creating your new story but for now um find your unique way if i can give you a little bit of um advice because that's why i'm here after all um research actually shows that most people do better with low carb eating plans um so it doesn't mean that it has to be a punish rem punishment remember healthy living shouldn't be a punishment um so make sure that you're having fun with it as well and i do provide so many different carb alternatives and the great thing is there are so many different options available now um, wherever you go into your grocery stores and things like that um, so it makes life a lot easier especially to bring about a lifestyle change if you tend to eat a lot of like breads and pastas and things like that and um, there are such great carb swaps that you can do and again feel free to follow our social media accounts um, on facebook and instagram and youtube because there are so many tips and things that i share there on a regular basis as well so if you need some assistance and of course if you want to go deeper do get in touch of course comment below as well if you have any questions i will pop in to see if there are questions as as we go um and yeah as always i would love to hear from you but remember you are unique which makes you you so you be you and find your way around it and again something that fits in with your personality and your lifestyle because then it'll make it easier and remember my whole mission is to teach you now how to do weight loss and in an easy and effortless way okay so yes there are a few things that you need to change but we can make it easier um or the road or journey ahead all right so as I always also say, you can't find solutions from the same mind that created it. So let's see what your mind is doing currently. What's your mindset like? What are your thoughts like? Journal if you have to. So even after this, watching this, grab a little notebook or journal and write down everything you think about yourself. Literally, even if it's negative, even if it's positive, write down everything um, that you think about yourself or that tend to be in your mind or thought space um, regularly. Um, because that will give you an indication of what your current story is. And like I said, awareness is key number one. So we need to know what your current story looks like because you are creating it. 
daily as you go. So firstly, be aware of what your story is now, and then we can change it. So I'll give you a little bit more tips on that in the next episode. So make sure to go look at the next episode of the Fun Fat Loss um, series, as well as um, it is a 10 episode series. So there's a lot of golden nuggets in between and a lot of tips that I share from my heart to yours. And um, from the past 10 years of research I've done, tried and tested many things, and also working with patients that want to lose weight at our weight control clinic for the past 10 years. So these are my top tips. Again, feel free to ask your questions and yeah, get in touch. I would love to hear from you. And remember, you be you, you're unique, you're special, and you are magic. Don't ever forget that. Thank you. Mm-hmm.